four tales developed by Alchemy and published by Dear Villagers follows the story of Volpane the Shoebill and Leo the Tiger after a successful heist that resulted in them obtaining a special Lyre relic. However, the Lyre proves to be more than just a valuable artifact when Volpane starts experiencing ominous visions of the future, including the fall of the capital, Insenberg, and the immediate death of his father. On top of that, Leo ends up arrested, leaving Volpane in a difficult position where he must embark on an urgent mission to halt a curse that is plaguing the world. The game is designed around making decisions during every opportunity and all choices are influenced by card. The choices made during this mission are important as they each tell their own story. Each level is called a mission, and players can take up to three characters on each mission, well technically two as Volpane is a mandatory choice, and choosing a mission is crucial since not all of them can be played in a single play. The game uses a choose your own adventure path method, where certain missions can be locked out depending on previous choices. Additionally, past choices can, can affect future missions. Choosing which allies to employ during the missions can be challenging due to their distinct styles and card advantages. During missions, the game interface resembles a traditional card game, in the center are cards that represent the adventure and path to take. At the bottom, the players have their own cards that can be played. On the left side of the cards associated with the characters, which can be used to advance in the adventure and influence the cards on the right side. The right sided cards rep represent various forms of currency, such as money, food, fame, reputation, and fear, all which can be used on adventure cards or create an encounter. Every ally has a specific set of cards, while the player possesses resources such as gold, food, and fame, which can be expended based on the cards you play. The fundamental loop of the game involves playing cards on location cards in the center of the board, resulting in various outcomes which will either help you gain resources or lose them, discover new locations, or receive ally cards. You can always enter combat with enemies, but it's not always the optimal solution, and paying off enemies with gold using fame or providing food can be effective alternative. The player's choices in dealing with encounters and enemies influence the overall mission experience. The game stunning visuals, card art, cutscenes, and animations are a significant draw to the players seeking an immersive gameplay experience, and as you progress through the game, you'll encounter many allies, all with their own set of unique abilities, and all your choices dramatically affect the fate of these allies. The safe system, coupled with the game's sight, necessitates playing the entire game again to reach the final mission, which is a drawback of the game, but overall, Fortales is a game with a straightforward mechanism that many players will they can quickly grasp, and offers a unique exciting experience, blending both storytelling and card playing mechanics. The game is a 7 out of 10, and I can recommend to anyone who's a fan of card games. Thank you for watching and have a great day.